welcome to Bjorn's class on how to use a URL correctly. First, let's have a little bit of an orientation. First, this is a keyboard which you will use to type in the URL. Second, this is the monitor that you will use to look at the web page that results from typing in the URL and hitting enter. What we're looking at is a web browser and at the very top you'll see there's an address bar. Inside it you will see a URL. So to use the address bar of your browser you're going to go to the address bar, remove what's there already, or start a new tab in your address bar if you know how to do that, and simply type in the address that you want to go to. Many browsers have an autocomplete function. If, if the autocomplete function finishes the URL and it's exactly as it's written, then go ahead and hit enter. There you go, look, it went straight to the correct web page. The reason that I've made this tutorial is that because my mother and her students apparently don't know how to use a URL in an address bar. So now you and they, if they choose to watch this video, know how to use the address bar and enter URLs into it. There's no reason to go to Google and search for a URL. You already have all the information you need. If you go to Google and type in the entire address in the search engine, then you're adding an extra step. You may as well just go right up to this address bar and type in the address you want. Let's go to Google and see what happens when I type in a URL. You get a bunch of URLs that have nothing to do with the URL that we want. Some are describing domain registration information. Some are describing what the IP address of the server is hosting it. So the moral of the story is don't search for URLs at Google. Don't search up here for URLs. Type the URL directly in here. To search for a URL that you already have is akin to calling a network operator uh, like dialing zero on your phone and asking, what is the phone number for 1-800-COMCAST? It's ridiculous because you already have the phone number. So if you have the phone number, don't dial zero, just dial 1-800-COMCAST if you want to call Comcast. The same applies to a URL. If you already have the URL and you want to go to that URL, don't search for the URL. Just type the URL in the address bar where URLs go, and then hit enter. We'll do it one more time. And it will take you right to where you want to go. Thank you, and have a good day.